I am Dr. Nimish Patel. I want to thank you guys for joining us on Wellness Biosciences. I'm going to briefly talk about some of the products they offer and give you a basis of what CBD is. So I uh, began researching probably over the last seven to eight years on CBD products as alternatives, not only for my patients, but also for my family. Um, let's start with where CBD is derived from. It's from the hemp plant, which is the father uh, plant uh, of cannabis. Uh, there is no psychoactive properties in CBD, um, and it's actually found in your system through a system called the endocannabinoid system. Just as we have a parasympathetic and sympathetic system, we have what's called an endocannabinoid system in our body. That system is primarily found in our central nervous system, in our brain, our glands, our soft tissues, and in our skin. Part of this system has what's called a CB1 receptors and CB2 receptors, which basically take in exogenous CBD to help bring the body back to homeostasis and equilibrium. So most of the health benefits that have been noted through some of the studies that have been done primarily in Europe and in Israel have been noted on this system primarily. Uh, it's been shown to work as an anti-inflammatory component of the body. Just as uh, most exogenous systems work, when you take in CBD, it binds to the CB1 and CB2 receptors to help with inflammation throughout. Where I found primary benefit in this product uh, was when I had active patients coming in asking for alternatives for treatment for chronic neuropathy, chronic pain, uh, just ailments that weren't being treated with regular prescription-based medicines, um, I started looking into other alternatives and got a hold of CBD products uh, that were beneficial and they actually saw some benefits. Um, most of the data that's out there is not double-blinded, not placebo-controlled, which we're used to as clinicians. Most of the data out there is primarily in Europe and Israel, but as the FDA and the U.S. has started to deregulate hemp, uh, it's starting to come to fruition in the U.S. Um, as of December of 2018, the farm law was passed, which deregulated hemp and took it from a Schedule 1 to a Schedule 5, making it completely legal throughout the U.S. So CBD has become more on the forefront on alternatives without causing side effects as we typically see with prescription-based drugs. So most of the benefits I've seen is in helping anxiety, chronic pain, neuropathy, uh, insomnia, and other ailments that patients are dealing with. My personal note, uh, my mom uh, has early onset Parkinson's has been dealing with a resting tremor uh, pill rolling tremor, which has been getting worse. And her biggest complaint was not the tremor. It was just insomnia, trouble sleeping because of the shakiness. So she was ultimately on carbidopa, levodopa. She was on other prescription-based medications, Mirapex, Requip, Primadone, which just continued to make her more loopy and, and non-functional. And her only basis was to try to find a product that would help her function on a day-to-day -day basis. So I did some research, found a product, uh, primarily CBD-based uh, oil, which she's been taking, which has helped her tremendously uh, in helping her sleep, which has made her function a lot better day to day. So again, the, the bioavailability of this product uh, varies amongst patients. Uh, some people may have a better response compared to others. Primarily, that's based on how many CB1 and CB2 receptors are found throughout the body. Now, why choose wellness bioscience compared to any other product out there? It's always about quality. It's always about best in class. So when I back something or when I got approached about wellness biosciences, I did my own research on it, on what type of product, the purity, what tests were being done. And they put this product through rigorous testing, not only with the internal lab, but two other external lab testing uh, agencies before they go ahead and distribute the product. So those are some of the health benefits. I want to encourage everybody to do, do their own research. I also encourage uh, patients to go talk to their physicians. Again, everything needs to be approved by your own clinician beforehand. 
but I've seen significant benefits in using alternatives, and I think that is going to be the forefront of where the U.S. is headed in the near future. So I want to thank everyone for joining today. Uh, and if you have any further questions, feel free to go visit our website, and uh, I'll also be available for further questions, too, during Zoom calls. Thank you.